Welcome to Let's Talk Meshing's Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature in just a couple of minutes. In this video, we're going to show you how to use the Grid Dimension tool to copy dimensions from a connector or a string of connectors to another. So in this example, you'll notice that I have three connectors, and each have a dimension or number of grid points per connector. Now below is a connector with no dimension. It has zero grid points. And what I'd like to do is copy the total combined dimension of these three connectors to this target connector. To do that, I can select this connector and I can go to grid dimension, go to the copy from frame, and then start selecting the connectors that I would like to copy from. And I can select one connector or multiple that are connected together and click the copy dimension. And you'll notice that it copies the total combined dimension of those three connectors to my target. And I can click OK to accept that. Now the nice thing about this is if we move to the second example is say you're trying to build a balanced structured domain. If I select all of these connectors and try to assemble a structured domain, it's unable to because opposing edges don't have the same number of grid points. And you can see that this bottom connector does not have the same dimension as the connectors above it. So what I can do is I can select this connector, go to grid dimension, again, go to the copy from frame and select these three connectors to copy the total dimension. And I'm going to click the copy dimension dimension button, click that and click OK to accept. And now if I select all of these connectors and click assemble domains in the toolbar, I've now created a balanced structured domain. So that's how you can use the grid dimension tool to copy dimensions from a single connector or a set of connectors to another. If you like this video, please be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, drop us a line down below, or you can connect with us on Twitter, which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a pleasant Tuesday.